So Albert was coming in today for a mandibulectomy for a suspected tumor kind of at the main portion of his jaw on the lower jaw. And in order to know if that has just stayed in the jaw or moved, the next stop on the train is the lymph nodes. So it's a nice opportunity for us while he's out to go ahead and get a sample from those lymph nodes while the surgeon's working on the jaw to then be able to say, oh, no, a lymph node's positive now for spread, go ahead and take that lymph node. So even though it images well on uh, CT and we didn't see any highlighting, it gives us another for sure we're okay that this is a localized tumor and by doing that surgery it's really going to help him versus if that lymph node was positive and we got that answer back in that timely fashion she could turn around and go ahead and take that lymph node out while she still has him under anesthesia. So selfie allows us to talk directly to the pathologist and the pathologists are working in real time which means that they're uh, using the camera to kind of look at the slides as we're there so if they have any questions they can text message or ping us and we can do the same when we're worried about a case or need to give them more information on the cytology to help guide their read. Uh, it really does allow you to have that one-on-one -on -one relationship with a pathologist and be able to get very used to how they read things and uh, feel comfortable with the diagnosis when it comes back. So the benefit is that we do get that answer within a, a timely fashion, especially if we're still prepping for surgery and then heading into surgery. So within about a half an hour, we can get that answer and then make some decisions uh, whether to continue with the process or add another site to take off surgically. Uh, that really helps us to benefit the patient for just the one anesthesia so we don't have to come back and do something else the next time. So ultimately when we have a facial tumor, we get worried that it's going to drain to a lymph node and being able to say whether or not it has moved or just localized really helps guide the surgeon and helps us give a good prognosis to the owner. Uh, once we know how we're doing surgically and we get those margins back, that's the ultimate answer for them, but they already have peace of mind that it doesn't appear to be in the lymph nodes.